esta pieza. Uh, come on. Stay stable for at least a minute. Are we back online? Right now the frames are no longer dropping, so that's good. I just don't know what the graphics look like. Okay, what does it look like on the screen? Okay, that is perfect. Oh my god, it's about time. Yeah, we're over a minute and it's here. So, and there's the frame drops again. Are we lagging? Not on your end. It's a like now. Yeah, I know. I'm just making sure, like, the stream, like, because the frames are dropping, and that's bad. That affects the overall, like, stability. And that's the last fucking thing we need. Okay, well, at least that's the thing. Let's just get on the Power World. Because we're going to be playing it. Uh, tomorrow, though, I am heavily debating on staying at home and playing the new Shokuma update. Everyone, so, like, I don't know if I'm going to be going to my locals or I'm going to be playing Power World. And, like, doing an extra long stream. I know tomorrow is supposed to be, oh... Final Fantasy Thursdays, but I think I may make an exception for like the new update. So let's start playing. Now I do feel like as content creators, as I tried to put up previously, we should never contact kids. In my eyes, like, when you're a content creator, when you're a streamer, you know, you're supposed to be like, Fuck them kids! Yeah! Oh. Because kids are nothing but trouble. I mean, they technically are. And as streamers, as content creators, it's our job to make sure we don't contact them kids. Because it can be really freaking bad. If y'all kept up with my career so far, y'all know I dealt with a dumbass. And there's a comic literally explaining my a battle with that dumbass. And he's definitely one of those. Sadly... You know, dumbasses will be dumbasses. And sometimes you just can't stop a dumbass. Or even help them. So they're gonna be what they're gonna be. So I'm here today ready to go farm some wood. And, uh, more minerals. As from behind the scenes, I did get the new, sh uh, the, uh, epic shield. So that'll be better for, like, defensive reasons. We're gonna go get the wood. You know what, screw it, we're just gonna go outside the base. Screw 
So, oh, I've also unlocked the iron walls. The, like, steel walls everywhere. Take that wood up, at least. So, yeah. That wood up. Gonna remove the shotgun, put the axe on. I am full aware of the drama. Now, I myself, well, oh, I have to say, I don't watch Dr. Disrespect stuff. For many of years, though, I do know he entertained the masses, made people love his content, you know, by playing video games constantly. He was a video game guy. I'm a video game guy, too. But there is a line in the sand when it comes to, obviously, what he did. And it's messed up. Last night, y'all heard another, like, kind of a bit of an MP3 slash audio file between me and Joey. And so, we talked about our feelings on the uh, VTubing platform and how they feel about 3D. You know, not being a successful platform for, like, VTubing. Now, I myself... And Joey, we both agreed, and we really do agree, 3D has great potential. But at the same time, it's, it's the opinions of the big boys and girls in the scene, or like big men and women in the scene, in the v 2 scene, that really overall harshes the mellow of it and doesn't give it the proper credit. There is a few that still do it, but they do it with VR headsets. I don't have one of these things. Those, those things are like way too expensive for me right now. And I'm really not a VR player. Y'all do hear some water in the background dripping. With that, I humbly apologize. That's because, obviously, my kitchen sink's fucking broken. I'm waiting for a repair crew to come in here and fix it. So, if you hear a slight little drizzle or not, it, it can't be helped. But, uh, yeah. Now, the first comic of Depp and Fox, well, the first comic in general called C Next Gen Comics, this was an extra mission comic, meaning that extra missions are like side missions, but, uh, you know, not actually taking part of the official, like, oh, VTuber or uh, C stories. This is just something like, no, these versions of the comics are to let y'all know, oh, this happened, and, you know, obviously, it's just a funny way to tell y'all all that, all this happened with the VTubers, and it's finally come to a close, or, like, a certain incident happened. This is more like of a side story mission quest of comics. Just to let you know what happens in our lives. I think it's an interesting retrospect on how to develop my first comic. And it's out. But what y'all don't know is the secret ending is on the Discord. It's literally shown on the... Well, it's said there on the Twitter... Or slash X account. Yeah. Guess what? 
you want on the big ending, you're gonna have to go to the Discord. You wanna see what finally ends at the end? Discord. I'm doing this as a marketing tactic, obviously. I need to cover also, yet again, how the security function app works on the Discord. Yes, it works. It looks like it doesn't work, but it's supposed to work, and it does. It is capable of working, and, it, and I will be quite blunt, it does. The security is top tier. Why is it like this, though? Well, it's simply because, one, when certain light cancers attackers attack in Discord, this is supposed to look deceptive. It's supposed to look like it's not going to work, but then it works. And they get booted off the server when they overstep their bounds. I did this in a way to not only enforce my Discord, but to make sure that obviously the people that attack the Discord, you know, learns this is not okay, and I just got kicked from it for life. Well, not entirely life, at least until I feel like I fit. Oh, they can either be trusted and they learn from their mistakes, or, you know, we just keep them away. There are several accounts banned from the Discord from obviously causing a lot of mischief. And there was a lot of mischief. mischief. But uh, yet again, I think I'm going to rely on, uh, literally like avoid mentioning the Discord for a while after this, simply because... I'm going to keep focusing on my content. There will be another comic next week. I'm going to try to bring these comics out once a week. You know, there's going to be the official um, battle timeline. There's going to be like the E, obviously. That will resolve around. The next gen operations actual storyline. Then there's gonna be a, the overall fill for the seed next gen side missions, and the, and you got that of the seed next gen extra missions. The extra missions are like the missions that were a part of the official story, but weren't. You know, relative to the plot. You got side, extra, and official mission comics. That These are three sets of versions of the comic that are supposed to be unique. I also know what y'all are thinking. That, wait a minute, doesn't Meriwether already do comics? Uh, yes, but he does the horny aspect. He, he, he does safe for work horny. We're doing actual action comics, you know, action, adventure, romance, that kind of stuff. He does safe for work horny. There is a difference. Meriwether really doesn't do action comics or mercenary comics as a whole. That's not his tank. That's not his business. And in the long run, you know, as long as he's like, oh, I'm okay with him doing his comics, then he's okay with uh, if he, I doing my comics, then he's not, we're not going to have any issues. We're two different type of comic creators. How's the stream coming so far? Pretty good. Okay, that's good. Like, there is no uh, lag spikes or anything? Like it happens. Like this. 
Okay, that's good, at least. That's something. How many people are watching other than you? Oh, freaking sweet. Just keep me up the day, like, once every five to ten minutes. Like, if, like, we have any trouble or there's any issues, you know, like, I need to know that because being up to date is important. It shows competence. It shows effectiveness. It shows professional... Oh, atmosphere. And, yeah. So, the comics of our uh, seed is going to be definitely a different take on VTuber comics. We combine 2D backgrounds with 3D characters and props. At times, you will see, like, 2D monsters in the comics because, like, there's not exactly 3D monsters that I can create through V-Roid Studios. So, more than likely, most characters, at least the humanoid ones, will be in 3D. The monsters will be in 2D, or at least try to come off like 3D. And, let's see here. Oh, right. And mm, certain other elements. Like, if I can find, like, 3D vehicles or ships or stuff like that that literally tickles my fancy, those will be in there instead of 2D, like, you know, versions of them. I do want people to join the Discord more effectively, but right now, I think as... Everything that has transpired recently, I think I should focus more on streaming and obviously the content creation and the comics creative as well, narrative as well. So, yeah. Also on the channel, if you go oh, over to one of the recent videos, you notice there's a power scaling video. Uh, this is to, and I quote, one to explain the current power level of my current being in the uh, VTubing dimension, <laughs> be quite frank. Two, this is also a way to deter attackers, at least dumb ones. It won't work against smart ones. Like, ones with at least more than half a brain cell. You know. That can tell fiction from reality. Won't attack. Will all try to attack. But the ones that have half a brain cell will probably back off. This is an attempt, obviously, to get them off. While explaining my VTuber's current strengths. Hobbies, likes, dislikes, favorite foods, favorite drinks, yada yada. It's a way to explain in a bit more of my VTuber and the current VTuber models that are going to be in that have been in production or still haven't been made yet. The next one we're going to focus on, like, from behind the scenes, is Jody Rimbo. As we're finally going to, behind the scenes, get his VTuber model up and running. As he's the monitor officer, and he watches things on the stream. Meaning that, yes, he makes sure... Make sure the stream is nice, safe, and stable, and gives me any reports. Like I said, add a um, seed, get seed next gen. 
you know, to the facts, uh, this video explains our goals, you know, and even that, how many models that are going to appear during these animations, because uh, most of the VTubers are going to appear only in a map animations, at least the student models. The student, uh, you know, like enemy models or monster models I can make will only appear in the e animations. While the main core cast of eight characters will appear on live streams here on Seed next gen streams. We are eventually planning to get more people to join the group, including that of personal friends. But right now, I do have my girlfriend planning to move in with me very soon. Also on the Twitter slash X, you just also recently learned all the Galactic Leyline map. There's a lot of art that's being uploaded to Twitter slash X going in more intricate explanation of like all the universal map. You got that of like the VTuber models designs and all that kind of crud. But uh, if you want this stuff early, like a few hours or even a day early, like I said, you need to join the Discord. The stuff hits there early. And it is free. Here I go trying to sell the Discord again. And to you people. Now I will mention another lying issue. I touched on it previously. And me and Joey talked about it. It was obviously... The big boys and girls in the VTubing scene and how they felt and how they continue to feel about me as a VTuber. I want to talk about now what they're saying. I'm full aware that now they're seeing all these video projects come out. And they're beside themselves. A lot of VTubers have a lot of, I have to say, staff to do their things. But the staff takes their time because they do all, like, a lot of other people's projects. So, why do, like, why is my stuff coming out faster than theirs? Well, this definitely shows the overall time and extent I have while also and I quote I've been perfecting this you know all of this of seed next gen for over 20 years it's all been in the head but it's finally coming to the internet as all I have to do is script it out you know use the models in the software and then and finally edit the video upload the video and then rinse and repeat as vtubers hire professional workers that which i'm not gonna say i'm professional if anything i'm gonna have to say i'm higher than amateur but lower than, like, the highest mid. I would have to say my editing style somewhere is high mid with my videos. But it is getting better. The V2B scene is wondering, like, you know, obviously, all the other content creators are now seeing everything that has dropped in the V2B scene and wondering, like, how is he able to do this so fast? It's because I put my time, my effort, my I, overall devotion, and my work schedule. Oh, currently, because I don't have a job, doesn't mean I haven't been trying to find one. 
I put a lot of current hard work into the development of my content until I can get a normal job, side job. When I do get a normal side job, of course, like the develop and the development of the content will slow down a bit. I know that's not what y'all want to hear, but as a man that needs like money in the fourth dimension, that is kind of important to survive in the modern day. Okay, so like, make it a hot the air griever. Okay, so like, gotta get some more charcoal. So I recently got this shield. It's equipped. What we need to do is make some, um, you know, like coils. I mean, a carbon fiber. To repair the shotgun and then we're gonna go oh cave spelunking and i don't know if we're gonna take on a boss today let's check our food supplies hey, we're doing pretty good doing pretty good. all right so what we're gonna do we're gonna go upstairs and we're gonna cook some while he's handling that okay thank you I at least this what hey everyone with the reports constantly coming in, and uh, obviously, we can try to be more efficient of streamers here on the channel. Like, efficiency is important, and that's what we're trying to go for currently right now, along with all the current projects. Ow! Like I said, I think I'm going to try to bring these comics out once every week. Maybe once every two weeks. To obviously bring out a continuous flow of content. From comics on, on the Twitter slash X account. First hitting the Discord though for like at least a few hours. To that of hitting the Twitter slash X while also creating original video content while streaming. This means I'm a multifaceted content creator that has experience in the field. And I really do. And when it comes to, ooh, the other VTubers, they're wondering who the fuck I am, or more likely they're thinking like, who the fuck this guy think he is? He's showing us up. He's showing how superior he is and how fast he can get projects out. Well, I can't help it if you people, oh God, uh, individuals that can't live up to your expectations or demands. That's not my problem. That's a you problem. And that's just the truth. The Stone Cold Old Lionheart truth right there. Another thing they worry about is, you know, oh, didn't you dox yourself by showing your face? Uh, yes and no. I do know it's dangerous, but at the same time, look at my VTuber. I'm humanoid. Uh, I'm a human VTuber. Uh, what I'm doing is called a marketing tactic. I'm marketing myself in a different way that they don't normally accept or see as norm. To them, that's too dangerous and even weird. And I hear them. I understand that. But at the same time, I really don't give a damn because I also do this to grow as a person. I need to, and I quote, grow as a person uh, due to my uh, uh, lack there of upbringing around people.
as I was protected for the longest time behind the scenes with my family. It didn't let me have the ability to grow as a person. But then you could argue, wait a minute, isn't VTubing the wrong direction for it? You could argue it is, or you can see it as yes and no, or then you can see it as, wait a minute, it's just a form of content. That which, I'm going to be quite honest, it's a form of content creation. Yes, I am a victim of the Yu-Gi-Oh! Um, uh, I am abuse of nature, er, but I'm not going to let that stop me as a whole. And myself, I'm enough. Oh. Oh, we got weather incoming there, Joey. We got a galactic storm on the way. Yeah. Take a look outside the galactic window. Looks like we've got a little bit of acid rain from the local old galactic ley line. And meaning that uh, because of rain today, everyone, the stream may suffer a bit, but we'll do our best to entertain. So, yeah. It's going to be starting the storm according to... Uh, so like the wet weather reports in about an hour. So if the string has, you know, issues, Joey will report it and we'll try to do something about it. Wow, this thing really performs fast. Like, crafting on this thing is like a breeze. Let's get at power. Oh, it's going by a little bit more faster. Gotta love my giant flower power palmon. <laughs> I wonder what happens if I equip those pendants of due diligence, how fast it'll go then. <laughs> Yeah, I know, right? Because, like, they increased the work speed at least about by 80%. Or was it 70? I can't remember. But, uh, yeah. We're gonna get the shoddy repair. We're gonna make some more ammo. And then we're gonna move on out and, like, try to complete these, um, pile decks entries. Probably hit up, like, an animal reserver too to see if we can get some better schematics along with some more higher end caves because we need to prepare for power world strokema update flame force we were promised blaze of guns we were given and even that of various new palmons a new boss Oh my yards! I am actually excited for this. Okay, let's repair the shotgun. And like the next level, there is something we're gonna be getting. I'm gonna be getting my sword back. I want my sword back. I miss my sword. I mi I, I, I miss those. I miss my best friend, my swordsy. I want it back. Yes. My sword completes my eye character. Of course. Even in Power World, chat, I want my swordsy back. It's my best friend. It talks to me. It makes me feel happy. But so what if you have to Depends. Can I fuck the sword? More likely the sword will fuck me over, so no. Because, <laughs> <laughs> like, that hurt. I, 
Chat, let it be known, like, you know, I may have divine healing and resurrection, but I can still feel pain. That shit hoists. I don't like pain. Even though I can recover from it, I still don't like pain. It hoists. So that's a thing. <laughs> Even though I'm a bit of a mask in the bedroom, doesn't mean that it doesn't hoist. I still don't like the feeling of pain, but I if you ever recover from it, then it still hurts. You know? <laughs> like coins a bitch. <laughs> So, oh, a couple of days ago, you saw like Rachel was pissed. Yeah, yeah, that's what you get. That's what you get for forgetting your anniversary of your first date. How do you feel? Hi, Donald Trump here. How do you feel that you pissed off your future wife? I don't like it. Well, that's what you get. Maybe you should build a wall between you and her. <laughs> God dang. Like, I like that we, he, me and Joey, like, after a few minutes in the stream, we decided we were going to be a little bit, like, going off hinge and trying to be funny and witty today. Like, after all... <laughs> I want to do some voice impressions because y'all see me hear me do Alucard because like if you don't know if I can't do Team Four Stars Alucard, well here's a bit of a uh, act for you. Well, hello, chat. How are you today? It is I, the Crimson Fucker, the Vampiric Asshole. Even that of Taka are not. Bitch, Alucard, how are you today? <laughs> That's right. I'm in the house. I'm inside your walls. And I'm here to fuck your mothers. And have vampire children. <laughs> Heck, I can even do the hell major. Uh, from Team Four Star Bridge, allow me to um uh, prepare prepare myself because like let's do a little unhinged like in you know like impersonations, not imperson acts of like you know certain characters here today. I want to do some voice acting. So, in other words, of, like, other characters. Ah, hello there, L. Alcott. How are you today? Honestly, do you think you can be a little less, you know, perverse with your overall all attitude? Oh, shut up. Honestly, you think hey, they would have gotten tired of you after the World War Three you tried to call? Still trying to overall be a fan of you. And wait a minute, I don't want to find it. Yeah, I I think Oh okay. People on Twitch chat or thank you for following supporters channel. Wait. Okay, like. Yeah, that's not bullying. Like, why'd the auto mod do that shit? That wasn't bullying. That was just thanking everyone for being around here daily. 
So, oh, yeah, pretty much. Let's see here. All right. Continuing on. So, that was a hell major, but how about that German Nazi bitch with the sign? Oh, you know, I want to see how this puns is out. Oh, I think the guys Germans can't be funny. Oh, nine. There's so much more I want to know. Uh, I, I don't know how I feel about how oh, oh, I can do that one. But, uh, again. So, uh, let's see here. Hmm. What's the next one I can do? Oh, here's a classic. Hey! Hey there, Yugi Bubba, buddy. Let's get those picnic baskets. <laughs> I don't think the ranger's gonna see this one coming. <laughs> oh, Yogi, I don't know about that. Last time the ranger overall caught you getting picnic baskets, he got really upset. And even more than that, he said he would literally put you in the cage next time. Well, I don't think he's gonna catch us this time. No sorry, no sorry, Bob. Don't worry there, Boo Boo Buddy. We're gonna get him this in time. Ah, <laughs> uh, let's see here. Um. Oh God, when I was younger, I used to be able to do Donald Duck, but I can't do that anymore. I guess I can do a different one. Oh, no, like, I can't do Daffy Duck for the life of me. Oh, my God, that voice is impossible for me to do. Uh, <laughs> Hello there, fuckers! It's I, Mickey Mouse, from the House of Mouse. How are you today? It's like, does anybody want a keyblade up the ass? Because I got one just for you! So an unhinged Mickey Mouse I can do. A Devil Artemis edition to be exact. Can you do it, you? <laughs> well, hello there. I got this mallet, Mickey. How about overall I give him a good old whack of goo? <laughs> unhinged Goofy. Ah. Uh... I used to do, uh, like when I was younger, I used to be able to do Miss Piggy. <laughs> I'm not proud of that one either. I can't do it anymore, chat. H how about this one? Like, y'all have any person, like, anybody watching the stream have any personal requests of voice acting? I'll see if I can try to do it today. Like, any personal request whatsoever y'all have, uh, put it in the stream chat box. We'll see if I can do it. I'll let you know if I can or cannot. Because, like, I do want to get my voice tack acting talents out there, but, you know, I want to save it for streams. So, I guess I really should put up, oh, like, do a donation, and in the near future, you know, I'll try to do a voice acting skit. That'll be fun. Oh, by the way, did Pippo's voice box go off on the stream when oh, you put I, that in? I had to go. No, like, when you typed, like, the... Because it's supposed to either have Tifa or Eris' voice go off when you literally type something in chat. Oh, God. God damn it. Maybe I need to go with a different program for that. I think that's only during donations. Pippo works that way. Like when people oh, put in bits or like cash or something like that. Pippo's voice happens. That's how that thing works. So. Sadly, like. I don't think it's working proper early, or either that it's just nobody's donated yet. 
that which, you know, bit donations and money donations do work. They have been working for a while. Just don't break yourselves over the bank, everyone, for it. But I get I'm not popular enough to have, like, people do that. But still, it will help out with the near future content. Any and all support. And possibly get me, have me hire other people to voice the models as well than what we got. Because if I, I can actually hire people to start being VTubers, that would actually be a lot more better for the different models. I do want to hire people to voice the models. But I need a little bit of green to do that. So, yeah. Yeah, that one's taking a while, so we're going to bring out Phantom Rose. Phantom, help me. Feel like Now we know how fast shotgun shells take to make on this thing currently. I guess we're going to make some more. We do need the shotties. Let's see, we got five. We're going to go with... 14. Now there's 70 shells. I guess we need to do five more after this one. Once we get the shotgun, like, all prepared, we're going to make some rifle ammo, and we're probably going to head out. Here in Power World, we're grinding up to try to get better for the game, at least. These update, and who knows? Maybe some of the items will already be unlocked with the previous levels. That'll be stonks. That'll be awesome. I, I want that. I want that now. I want that. I want those stonks. No stonks. Stonks. That means obviously, you know, I want that bank. <laughs> Give me that bank. I want that bank stuff. I, I want that new stuff. I'm waiting for it. I need it. I want it. I desire it. I gotta have it. <laughs> so that's a thing. So, yeah. Let's see here. So, oh, I also, well, like I said, there was multiple characters. And y'all got the first character. Now, power analysis video. I did realize I left out the hip pull. But y'all should understand how Final Fantasy works. The highest amount of hip a character can get is 9,999. Kind of redundant. I mean, sure, that's what my hip's at. But, at the same time, you know, I should have put it on the analysis. I didn't. I'll put it on future analysis. And, like, Seed really doesn't rely on, like, magical energy. But we rely on junction magic. There's also going to be a video exp explaining the uh, magical adaptation system. Or the magical junction adaptation system to be more exact. Imagine a system kind of like Mega Man's weapon adaptation system. But implemented into the uh, you know Final Fantasy's junction system. For like drawing. You know like. Oh. You have a way to, like, analyze instead of draw. You analyze the magics, and you get new magics that way. Instead of, like, doing rapid amount of draws, you analyze one magic. You gotta wait a while for the magic to be developed, and then, like, it's at your disposal. 
that's how like the magical adaptation system is supposed to function and what I'm going with. You um, scan and analyze the magic or even the guardian force or summon for uh, those who are more uh, keen to the idea of summonable creatures oh. as called summons. As, yeah, you scan them and then the scan is sent into Seed HQ. They analyze it. They then they study it, they develop it, and we just ran out of power. I guess we gotta get the electric bird out. We gotta get Thunderwing out and like recharge the electrical all generator. Oh yeah, nah, nah, it ran out of power. Charge it up, boy. <laughs> I guess developing all that ammo really did number. I guess we also got to develop some more uh, generators. Because that's kind of important right now. More electrical generators mean obviously more electrical power. I had quite a couple of them before, but we lost that save file. Uh, Rip Taya Planter. Hey, her account, um, Taya Planter's save file rests, well, in the Shadow Realm, I guess. Uh, gonna get that one back. Let's save here. It's buffering a little bit. Yeah, I see that. I see that on my end. Like, how bad is the buffering? It started again. It started again? Okay. How often does it happen? Okay, that is an issue. What's this? Uh, what's the viewer account look at? Viewer count. You know how many people are watching? How many views? Uh, okay, that's good. As long as we're pulling in an audience, that is good. Let's see here. So, there will be character analysis videos of all the main eight core characters brought out on the channel and tell all, like, obviously they're all done. There's eight characters. There's myself. There's Kai Voltaire, Greta Marjorie, Joey Rimbaud, you got Iris Kramer, you got Geo Strider, Rachel Dragonstorm, and Ashi Williams. And they'll come out in that order. Meaning that, obviously, next week will be Kai Voltaire. Y'all will finally get at his power analysis of his abilities and capabilities. Sadly, I'm the only one with, uh, that the level limiter broke and the unlimited potential. But, at the same time, kind of re I guess I need to go into explanation why I decided to make my character so freaking busted. So, we see characters like Superman, right? Goku, Saitama. All these characters with, like, all this power or at the same time like their potential eventually becomes limited now you can argue you know superman's power it's not limited it's shit that's not good at all yeah i see that Anything in, has it regained itself? Not yet. Not yet. All right, we'll wait until I get back. We can like what the fuck. Uh, anything yet? Okay. 
That's a problem. Let me know if anything changes. Like, maybe you need to refresh the page. Oh, yeah. Yeah, because, like, sometimes they, um, you know, people's internet and cop out here. No matter how good it is. Like, I'll bring it up on my end. Visitor has left the base. Okay, it's Okay, that's good. All right. Yeah, it was just your internet. Okay. So. Sorry about that, everyone. My uh, monitor guy, Larry, called me that his internet was lagging. And I thought, oh, the stream was lagging. So. Well, I'm using your internet. Oh, okay. That makes a lot of sense, actually. Let's see here. I don't have enough for high quality. I guess, like, we're gonna let the bird charge it all up. And then we're gonna finally head out. Should hunt for some more electrical organs to have more electrical generators over here. Like, how many, like, I guess we need to replace some of these stone walls with steel walls. Oh, he's doing that. Like, how? Got a hundred and fifty. It's how much cement? We got eight cement. We need more cement. We need more cement. That's gonna be important for it. Cause like these stone walls, these steel walls are made out of cement and steel. So we're gonna have to have to make some cement. Chat, we're gonna have to build a wall. We're gonna have to build some walls, chat. We have to keep the Avengers outside of the country. I'm I'm scoring up the Donald Trump and depression now. That's bad. That's screwed. Donald Trump thing is run its course. <laughs> it's run its course. Do you need to run a meeting? Yeah, it is. <laughs> yeah, it's run its course. Like my voice stability just fell apart with that one. <laughs> Let's see here. I'm also familiar, like, with that one, like, uh, VTuber convention that fell apart. Um, like, it was supposed to happen, but then, like, oh, it didn't happen. Like, False Eyes covered it. Like, the guy is actually pretty good covering, like, all these conventions that make these mistakes. All these big-time VTubers, like, and they're, like, crisis. He's good at covering that ad. What he calls drama, I just literally call it VTuber news. Like, VT news. It's it's basically the news. Like, why they kind of call it VT drama, I don't know, but... It's basically news. It's what it is. Can, can I slap Joey? I'm gonna slap him right now. <laughs> I'm gonna slap you, yes. I'm not just gonna slap you and last week. I'm gonna slap you to the end of time. Is that a threat? But, yeah, y'all also find out in the comic a little bit of information. I guess I need to bring this up. Uh, there was a count with two yellow hearts called In the Murder Drone. His YouTube channel is deleted. It's gone. And there's a reason for that. It seems.